We're dealing with rashes. We're dealing with rolled ankles. <laughs> we're dealing with some situations today. We're in survival mode, baby. The survival mode. You know what these types of vlogs turn into. You just film what you can. Oh, man. What are you going to read? This one? Rub a dub tub? Rub a dub dub. Three men in a tub. Mm. little enchilada action tonight, a little enchilada action. We're surviving, folks. We are surviving, right, Joseph? Boy. Seth, how do you feel? You feel okay? <laughs> do you want me to get you something, buddy? You want me to get you anything? Living the good life. <laughs> Living the good life. Pitch taken for a strike. Martin ran up. It was a comebacker, and he reached up. Now Seth has a hundred and one degree temperature. What is happening, people? Holy smokes. We're just trying to stay calm and stay calm and calm. Okay. I, <laughs> I'm, it's tempting to mow the backyard, but I need to rest the ankle. So I'm going to resist, even though it needs to be mowed. It's getting a little shaggy back there, but I'm going to resist. Whew. Instead, I'm going to seek a little beauty with you. Go. It's Monday. You know what that means. Comment of the week. But before I dive into that, I just got to explain. I'm filming with a different camera the last four days, five days. The other camera had to go get a cleaning, if you know what I mean. So it's in the shop getting a little TLC. So that's why the framing is off. Coloring is off. Everything's off a little bit, and I apologize. I just am doing my best with it, but it's a, it's not a, it's, the camera is not as nice as the other one. Just want to let you know. All right, comment of the week goes to, let me find it. Oh, the suspense. Here it comes. Yes, Russell. All right, here it goes from the race vlog two days ago. I th you got so many of you commented. Thank you for the support and encouragement and um, enthusiasm for my attempt to get across that finish line. All right, Russell said, dude, massive respect for the gutty finish. Blood is temporary, but pride is forever. Exclamation point. This is refreshing to see since it's so easy to simply jog or limp in at the end of an ultra and take whatever place that yields. Self-excuses are endless and loud. And no disrespect to hand-holding finishers. But I think as competitors, you both respect the desire to finish your very best. Well done, Seth. Onward and upward. I don't know. I just think, Russell, you encapsulated the moment. You captured the moment so well in words. Because I was not bitter. I was not bitter. I was distraught at my bl the blood coming out of my body. But I wasn't bitter, you know... If he would have, like, you know, if the guy would have, like, elbowed me, he was not, like, trying to take me down. Uh, we were, we were, we were gun, like, first of all, the course should have been wider. It should have been wider, but that's for another, that's a topic for another day. Now I know next year to go, to go wide, go wide next year, right? So, uh, anyway, Russell, thanks for the comment, and I appreciate it. And I appreciate all of you, and I just want to say that today was a little bit of a survival vlog, meaning, hold on, time in. Today was a little bit of a survival vlog, meaning I didn't film a lot, I was in catch-up mode, and 
this is what you get. This is what you get. And I appreciate you still being here. Just know that true love's home. I gotta go. I gotta go. We're here for you. You're here for us. We're here for each other. Let's go. Seek beauty. Work hard. Love each other. Gotta go.